friends today in this video we are going to learn how for protection of this three phase motor how to connect this with bmr relay this relay i have provides protection from over voltage under voltage single phasing reverse phasing and also unbalanced voltage so i am going to do the connection of this relay with this starter this relay i have to this relay first we have to connect power supply if power supply is connected to this relay then relay will first monitor the power supply and after monitoring it protects the motor so here what we have to do first is this r phase power supply here with this power supply connect one wire and to this one number terminal of this relay connect this wire with this terminal after this take y phase also and connect this wire with two number terminal similarly this b phase power supply is connected with three number terminal of this relay for now connection between contactor and relay is done from below if you want you can connect this from top also but one problem you may face when doing connections from the top i will discuss this problem later if here some kind of problem occurs then this relay here this relay will turn off this contactor how this will turn off contactor you will understand in control wiring to perform control wiring here you need a mcb i am connecting incoming supply to this mcb from r phase with output terminal of mcb connect one wire and to the 96 number terminal of overload relay or 95 number terminal with any one of these terminals connect this wire now we will get output supply at this point power supply from here will go to this stop push button so connect one wire from here and provide incoming power supply to stop push button now from stop push button power supply will go to start push button with output terminal connect one wire and provide incoming power supply to start push button on pressing start push button power supply will go to a1 terminal of this contactor it means contactor now receives phase supply now in this contactor at a2 terminal we have to connect neutral power supply at this terminal so bring the neutral power supply and connect directly with a2 terminal here if your contactor is of 415 volt then connect another phase supply at this terminal to turn on this contactor we completed the circuit here but still connection of vmr relay is left for this what you have to do the holding circuit we have with this holding circuit we have to use auxiliary contact of this relay in this vmr relay 5 and 6 number terminal here these are ano contact this ano contact need to be used what we will do with output terminal of stop push button connect one wire and connect other end directly with 5 number terminal from 6 number terminal power will be supplied to ano terminal of this contactor here i made ano contact now what we will do with this 6 number terminal connect one wire and to this ano contact of contactor provide input supply to this ano contact from output terminal of ano contact connect one wire and with output of start push button connect this wire so this circuit which you can see right now is holding circuit with this holding circuit ano contact of vmr relay here is connected in series what happens when this contact is connected in series with holding circuit look here to turn on motor when you press start push button motor will be turned on if there is no problem in your three phase power supply if there is some voltage related problem here then in this condition this vmr relay here this vmr relay will keep this contact ano in this condition this contactor cannot be hold it means this motor here will be turned off automatically but if the power supply here is okay then ano contact becomes nc and holding circuit is there through which motor will keep on running now if you connect this wire from here and provide power supply directly then this contact which we used here need to be connected in series with stop push button but if you connect this relay from here then a problem may arise is if in your contactor or overload relay there is some problem then in this condition you won't get any protection it means power will be continuously supplied to motor so it would be better to do the connection from below so friends i hope you like this video thanks for watching this video